He's a little rascal. He never stops. Just like you did, you know? Heads up. Is that him? Yep. Wait here. Sean! What happened? Jake, I'm not mad, but you better explain everything. I didn't know where else to go. Listen, I, I saw Daniel come back to the camp that night. Like he was in shock or something. Then I heard all these sirens and I got scared. I just, I packed a few things. I, I took a blanket from your tent and we, we left together. I also kept the cash you made on the farm. Uh, it's in my car. You did right, Jake. Thank you. You have no idea what he looked like when I found him that night, Sean. He was in bad shape, with a gunshot wound, and all by himself. I, 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 I couldn't just leave him there. What about the others? Hannah, Penny, what happened to them? They, they ran over to Merrill's place when they found out Finn and Cass were gone. That was the last time I saw them. Then on our way out here, Daniel told me more about what happened that night. How scared he was. The blast. Daniel feels he's got to redeem himself for what he did. I need to get to him, Jacob. He's not guilty of anything. I should have protected him better. I'm telling you to be careful with the Reverend Mother. She's waited her whole life for somebody like Daniel. The Reverend knows how to manipulate people. She's good at this. He wants to stay with her. Daniel has faith in the Reverend now. Yeah, not afraid of that Lisbeth of yours. I'm getting Daniel out of here. Come on. There's no way they're gonna let you take him away. Well, too bad. We're not gonna ask for their permission. You must be Jacob. I'm Karen. Hi. Okay. I don't know if you want to do this, but I... I have an idea. I think school must be over by now, but Lisbeth will stay at the church with Daniel for his special classes. That'll give us time to sneak into the compound before we get to them. I'll be on the lookout. Keep watch, in case it all goes to shit. Sean, stay on the walkie. Sounds like a plan. One more thing. I, uh... We have to get my sister, too. Sarah Lee. <laughs> really, Jacob? Come on, man. She's with your parents. I know. Please, listen, Sean. <sighs> She's not safe here. She's sick. They believe in everything Lisbeth says. And she says she'll cure Sarah with prayers. I know you understand, right? Damn, Jake. We need his help too, Sean. Okay, Jake. I'm listening. Lisbeth knows what's wrong with Sarah Lee. We just, we need to find her medical record. I think it's in her home office. Then I'll go get Sarah Lee while you get Daniel, okay? Fine. Sure. I'm gonna trust you on this, Jacob. All good for you, Karen. What if Daniel won't go with you? He will. I know him.
Karen? I'm in place. I can see the whole camp. Let me know if you need anything. Be careful, Sean. Got it. Thanks. We gotta be careful now. If anything happens, let me do the talking, okay? Yeah, of course. Let's get this over with. Okay. Elizabeth's house is right behind the church, so in and out. Okay. And you sure Elizabeth will have those files on your sister? Watch out, Sean. There are people right outside. Oh, shit. How many? Just three. A man with his kid on one side, and a woman alone on the other. Got it. Thanks. People aren't supposed to come and go around the church once the service is over. Better to avoid them if we can. Karen, everything all right? Yeah, don't worry about me. I found the best hiding spot. The view is kind of great. Cool. Be careful, though. You never know. So, did you grow up out of here? No. In another community back east. When Elizabeth came out here to start Haven Point, my folks followed her and brought me along. Hmm. Must have been hard on you. Kinda. Eight-year-olds don't want to go to church all day. Oh. Come on. Well, hello, young Hackerman. What are you doing here? Oh, uh, hi. We're just... You know you're not supposed to wander around the church once the service is over, right? Right, I, I, I'm sorry, but we, we were just... Uh, my dad just forgot his uh, jacket in our reverend's home, so he asked me to go get it. <laughs> that is so Robert, and he's too proud to get it back himself. You know the man. Okay, well, just hurry up. We'll be closing the gates soon. <laughs> no, no worries. I'll just grab it and go. Sounds like she has a soft spot for your dad. Okay. There it is. Looks empty. <sighs> Let's hope so. Luckily for us, we never close our door. A closed door is a closed heart, she says. No one's in sight. <sighs> Good. That's where I live. That big house over there. <sighs> you live in a castle, dude. Uh, no. There's actually four families in it. What? Seriously? Yeah. It was the easiest thing to do when we built this place. <sighs> Man. That sucks. Well... You get used to it. Can't believe Daniel really lives in this depressing house. Oh, we did it. Now we have a little bit more time. Yes, we do. Nice work. So where are the files? Right there, in her office. Oh, of course it's locked. Her open door speech is just another lie. We gotta find a way in. 
Fuck. Think there's a key somewhere? Maybe she's too cautious not to have a spare set around. <sighs> Whoa. Are you okay, Jake? Evenings in here must be so much fun. Are you okay, Jake? Yeah. Yeah, no. It, it's just so full of memories and stuff. Hmm. <laughs> Lisbeth sure likes to be on pictures. Damn. This is so artless. Confide and convince? Fifteen steps to a good speech. <laughs> yeah, nice read for a saleswoman. The moat and the bean. And I thought Claire and Steven were old-fashioned. Coaxing lesson one. Get Daniel his favorite cereal. Whoa. This place is worse than army camp. Might be enough to open that door. This is a lot of pills. Especially for someone who doesn't believe in science. Daniel's haircut makes much more sense now. Nothing here. Sean, Does she even right believe there? in any of this? Uh, yes. We're trying to get into her office. She's locked it up, so it has to be there. Fine. I'll let you know if I see anything unusual. Got it. Does she even believe in any of this? Nice prison view, dude. I swear, even her bet looks stern. Okay. What the? She's completely obsessed with his power. Yeah, that will definitely explain what's going on with Daniel. Oh, 
Okay. I found a key. Good. Let's try it. Oh, shit. Looks like the Reverend Mother got this letter before Jake. Hey, I found your letter for Jacob. Too bad Lisbeth found it first. She took it from the mail? Damn that woman. Yeah, she checks everything that comes and goes into the community. What a great fucking family portrait. She sure likes to gaze at her own success. Don't see anything of interest. Whoa, they kicked her out of church? Now they're thirsty. Is this Daniel's room? Yeah. Man. It's depressing. Well, Lisbeth doesn't believe in material possessions, so... Doesn't mean you need to decorate your house like a prison. Is she forcing him to do this? Why is he accepting all that? He looks happy. Fuck. I can't believe I missed it. Happy birthday, Daniel. Oh, shit. People are really all over his power. So much for secrecy. What is this? Daniel Fisher? Oh no. No, that's total bullshit. And creepy. They're so cute. The Book of Daniel. 
So much for a hot dog, man. No matter what happened, I guess Finn was a real friend to Daniel. This is quite the change from Power Bear and friends. At least he didn't throw it away. Petty liked to have it back. Once he's out of this mess. At least he had a memory from home. Locked, of course. <sighs> Shit. Maybe it opens the other door. Did she teach Daniel how to play this? Yes, that's the one. Oh, perfect. Whoa. Is this her personal archive or something? Yeah. She keeps track of everything in here. Stuff about my sister must be in this one. Okay, I've got something. Must be what you're looking for. She has pneumonia? And for what I get, Lisbeth knows damn well she needs medical treatment. That's criminal. She's insane. Look, she has a file on you too. <laughs> you can take a peek and see how she really treats her flock. Man, what's all this? Were you like... Sick? Conversion therapy? Do they... Wanted to cure you from... Being... Pretty much. I always showed more interest in boys than girls. They thought I was a freak. A sinner. Is that why you ran away? Yep. <laughs> Took me five years to understand what was up. I was too scared, confused. I really did believe I was a sinner, so I thought I had to atone for my sins. Atone? For what sins? I don't get how they can preach this kind of crap. I mean, you met Finn and everyone. Are they sinners then? 
Of course not. I, I just didn't know different, Sean. I believed them. Damn, Jake. After a few years, I was in a really bad place. I, I tried to hurt myself. Elizabeth was very upset. We had a long chat. She told me I should leave. Go see the world and figure things out. I, I don't really get her, Sean. But Elizabeth does believe in all of this stuff. I had no clue about your life here. I'm... I'm sorry, Jake. I'm sorry I brought Daniel here. I was just so blown away when I saw what he could do. It was like a real miracle. I, I thought I'd, I'd found my faith again. Instead, I, I just heard him. Then let's make things right. We just have to get Daniel out of here. I hope so. And I'll get my sister to a hospital. Have her treated. I hope they'll help her. Yeah. Anything would be better than here. Right. I just hope they can still cure her. Sean, are you there? <sighs> What's up? You got company. That thug who works for Elizabeth. He's just holding some files. Doesn't seem to be on to you. This guy is dangerous, Sean. Hey, trust me. I have a good plan to get him out of your way. He'll give you more time. Just give me the word. Yeah. See what you can do. I will. Get ready. Sean, we gotta hide. Now. Hurry up. Come on, Sean, we need to hide. Finds us here, we're screwed. Hmm. Weird. Better tell Lisbeth about this. All right. Let's see. What the fuck is going on? Sean, do you think... It's gotta be Karen. Oh, he's gone. Let's get out of here. Oh, man, that was crazy. I really... I can't believe this type of shit still happens today. Shit. Why did Daniel tell her so much? I knew this guy was sketchy, but... Whoa. Okay. We shouldn't be here. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's go. Is hardcore, Sean. Yeah, I guess she is. So we're all good now? 
I'll go get Sarah Lee while you get Daniel. Then let's meet up at the car, okay? All right. You be careful, okay? You too, Sean. Good luck. Come in, Karen. See anything? No, you're all clear. Awesome. Talk later. Locked, of course. Mission accomplished? Yep. Now the hard part. Did you find what Jacob needed? Huh. And a whole lot more. Thanks for the help. That was... pretty sweet. I try. You... did well. Hey, I'm here if you need me, Sean. I know, Karen. Thanks. <laughs> no problem. So you know what you're going to do? No. But let's do it. Oh, Lord. Let your power speak through this young vessel. I am your humble Sean. servant and will obey your every command. Speak to me. It's Daniel. Speak. I told you, he's kind of special. Hey. Sean! You came back? And I know. Little cub. Come with me, Daniel. We're leaving. I'm sorry, Sean. I can't. She's full of shit, dude. And she's using you. Daniel has made his choice, Sean. But I'm offering you to join us again. Put your faith in me. And you'll be family. Never. So that's your final decision. May the Lord have mercy on your lost soul. It's time for you to leave our sanctuary, right now. Not without my brother. I'm not going anywhere. This is my home. She's my family now. Daniel, listen. She's not your family. Sean, who is she? Our mother. Uh. She came here for you. Oh, praise the Lord. Another miracle at our church. Wonderful. Uh, it's all right, Daniel. Go see her. I mean, she's right there. Don't be afraid. I... Uh, I don't know her. Of course. I know. This is hard for you, my son. Stop calling him that. You're just manipulating him, you sicko. <laughs> That's in the eye of the beholder. But since you are his mother, let me ask you, how could you let your child wander alone in the wilderness? Where were you when Daniel was lost? Where- Listen, Daniel. I came here as soon as I found out you were here on your own. I'm not on my own. Children are a gift from the Lord. They are a reward from Him. You were blessed with a divine gift. And you cast him out into the world. Who the hell are you? You might have been his mother once, but when you abandoned him, you also gave up your rights. Isn't your God all about forgiveness? You have no idea what the Bible says. How can you pretend to care about these two children? 
You left them and your husband to seek out your base desires. Daniel, honey, she's trying to trick you. Please, think by yourself. You're smarter than this. Daniel, she's responsible for what happened to your father. You don't know anything. It was an accident. That's what this world is about. Accidents, injustice, pain. I'm just so sorry, Daniel. I know. I know how much I hurt you and your brother by leaving. I know that's not enough, but I hope we can talk about this together. That's what I've been trying to tell your brother, and I'm so glad he listened. You gotta trust us. She's using you for her selfish desires. Daniel, this time the choice is yours. Are you going to believe her or me? I... Uh, I... That's right. You can't tempt Daniel from this garden. He'll stay with us, his true family. And we'll never leave him. Go to hell. Come on, Daniel. No! Oh! Holy shit. Reverend! Are you okay? Nicholas! They're, they're heretics! Sent to desecrate our, our church! Okay. What now? Don't you understand? This is over, uh, Sean. You have to talk to him. You can convince him, Sean. I won't leave you, Daniel. Not here. Don't be so stubborn, Sean. Your brother chose his path. Your friend, Sarah Lee? She's very sick. And Lisbeth won't take her to a doctor. What? She wouldn't do that. This is that. pointless. Daniel knows who to trust. I know. She went to see doctors for herself when she was in pain. She never waited for a miracle when she was in danger. What? Is that... Is that true? Reverend Mother? Have faith in me, Daniel. I know what I'm doing. God is speaking to me and to you. She was kicked out of her previous church. Yeah, they knew she was crazy. So she left and founded Haven Point. Why would they do that? Did she do something wrong? Liar! I left on my own because they were all blind. Don't believe his lies, Daniel. I found a letter from Karen, her mother, inside her house. She hid it from you, so you never know. She's looking for you. What? You told me she didn't want to see me. Uh, see what you have done? Hey, Inano. Uh, back off. No one is going to keep me away from you. I said stop! Uh. Don't. I came all this way for you, and nobody will stop me. I'll even cross hell or whatever if I need uh, Sean! He must learn. Listen, I did my best job to be a good brother. And I know I probably failed. I took you for granted. I put you in danger. And I'm sorry. Sure. Don't listen to him. He, he left you just like that harlot did. Shut him up. He can hit me as much as he wants. I won't give up on you. Uh, Don't hit uh, him. Don't let them do that, Daniel. <sighs> if 
If I could go back in time, I would. We'd be in our living room in Seattle. That would get us pizza and snacks, then pick the movie, because we would always fight about it. And he always picked your movie. But I can't do that. All I can do now is fight. Quiet! What are you waiting for? We're the best team in Anno. Stop so it! So we have to keep going no. forward. What are You're you gonna doing? You're gonna kill him! Please! He's my brother! You can burn down our church, but not our faith. Daniel knows you're telling the truth. Don't give up. Nothing, nothing is gonna stop me, Daniel. We're brothers. I know. Dad always said our blood link was the most important thing. You know it. Uh, please! Uh, stop! Uh, Leave him alone! Daniel! Listen to him! I won't stop! No matter what she does! I'll come right back! Again! And again! <laughs> I love you, Daniel. I do too. Shut him up! Now! Don't move! Just stop! If you want to kill me, then do it! I'm not afraid! Do it! Shoot! Don't! Go ahead! What? Shoot me in the face! And live with me! Now! Stop! <laughs> She was someone else. I'm sorry. Sean, we need to get out of here. Now. Oh no. No. You started this fire. You will all burn in this hell. Move. Let us go. Move it. But you won't leave this place. Not with me alive. Open the door, Inanu. Daniel. After all I did for you, you can still repent. I don't believe you anymore! Ugh.
And this is it. We made it, Daniel. What do we do now? Make our way across. You ready? Yeah. I think. <laughs>